What time is it? Take a guess. It is 4.50. Where are we going? New York. Oh, I can't do it. It's way too early. It's too early for this. Can we just skip ahead to the part where? Already right, in New York. Jason, skip ahead. I'm, just kidding. I'm, not, I'm not your boss. Maybe not. Maybe not New York. Just the airport. Shall we rock and roll? Let's do it, babe. Oh, you're a one. Mr. Grinch. That's the best part about the morning. Your socks. Ah, oh, I forgot it. Wow. The seasick crocodile, Mr. Grinch. It's the best part of really it. Having a morning voice. You can sing along to the Grinch. Ah, we're tired. Crocodile. Babe, are you so happy you got all day to put up with me? You're a mean one. Mr. Grinch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sleepy. Bye, Grinch. The St. George Municipal Airport. <laughs> oh, actually, it's the regional airport. That's the front door. We parked right here. $5 a day. You can't beat that deal. So, we are off to New York today. What we're going to do today, we're going to get to New York. We're shooting there for Gymshark. We're also there for my birthday. My birthday is, is my birthday tomorrow? <gasps> And do you, know what I, do you know what I want for my birthday? Mm -hmm. Just all I want is no vegan pizza in New York. We're gonna go get real pizza. Actually, anything you want. I'm gonna take you to any restaurant. Deal, so today, I'm finding the best slice of pizza in New York. So we got today and tomorrow and Monday off. So we have three days, well two and a half, because we get there tonight. And then we shoot with Gymshark for two days. We're gonna meet up hopefully with David and Doug, and then just party in New York. All right. Let's go. I'm wearing my Fitbit today only oh, because yeah. when I travel, I like seeing how many steps I take because you don't always get to the gym when you travel. So I'm gonna try to hit, I'm gonna try to hit 17,000 today. It's a lot. Good luck with 10. We're in an airport. That's true. 15, go. <laughs> Colder here in Salt Lake. You know that was an early morning flight because the sun's not even out yet. Oh, and I look super duper tired. Thanks, personal baggage assistant. I'm bad girl. Lady. Call me bad woman. Bad woman? Bad woman. Sounds awful. <laughs> Sounds much worse than the muffin man is in your butt. Just saying. What did you just say? No. People have been leaving Muffin Man so comments. So every one of you guys, well not every one of you, but a majority of you guys have been commenting on my photos saying like, do you know the Muffin Man? And it makes you feel bad? That you guys keep commenting all these Muffin Man things on my photo. It makes me sad. Guys, just leave more comments about Muffin Man. Stop! <laughs> do you know the Muffin Man? I'm taking off here in Salt Lake. We'll see you in New York. Konnichiwa. What is it? He just said it on the Delta thing, so I don't think that's you later. Just touched down here in NYC and wow, first snowfall of the year. It is nice and chilly out there. I always remember growing up on my birthday. If it had snowed, my parents would take us hooky bobbing. That's in the back of the car. Like we tie, we tie our sleds up to the car and go up and down the street with the snow. What? It was the best thing ever. I had all my buddies out. That's a lot of snow right there. And I didn't pack my snow boots. I didn't either. So enjoy the snow. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh yeah. Never been to New York when it is snowy out. Good afternoon. Hey, oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Beautiful. So, Gymshark was, was kind enough to send us out here a few days early and get us this awesome, awesome hotel. And because so Babe loves me so much, she had this harp sculpture brought yeah, in. I had it like made. Oh, they got coffee here. There's a dry bar across the street for Courtney. We're good to go. 
Oh, we made it finally. And somebody's a cranky pants because she needs food. I'm so hungry. I'm not cranky. This is a super cool hipster hotel though. I don't know. All I know is uh, we're probably the least cultured people in this cool hipster establishment. Hey, look at that piece of artwork. We didn't need to go to Art Basel this weekend. Just the fact that I know what Art Basel is and I'm from Idaho makes me feel like I'm pretty cultured from being from Idaho. <laughs> Speaking of culture, I need some freaking pizza. That's Italian, right? Let's go eat. right here with tons more Santas in here. This doesn't look like your cup of tea. It's okay, I'm good. I'm You're along for the ride? Why are all those Santas over there? I mean, why would anyone want to be an anti-holiday bar? I guess that is kind of me in November, when people start playing. Look at that Santa peeing off the top. Huh? Like this style? We got pizza by the slice, not gonna be bad. Oh, no worries. Where are we right now? <laughs> All right. You can't come. You can't come to New York for deep dish. What's that? Oh, I plan on trying the wall. I'm thinking that way. I don't know. I'm gonna go with this pepperoni here. Yo, nothing like eating pizza with a bunch of Santa Claus in in, in Manhattan. I've been fasting all day. No, I haven't. <laughs> That's a huge pizza pizza, babe. Good? The crust is amazing on there. It's not as good as Joe's pizza, in my opinion. Joe's is better. I plan on eating a lot of pizza, though, on my birthday weekend. Hi, hey, Joe. Yo, there's Santa Clauses everywhere. Look at all of them. 